Having two screens, Surface Duo is an incredibly versatile device. And I think that there's a particular use case, something that I actually did use the other day, that is probably as weird and almost silly as it is awesome. So the other day while I was publishing the latest episode of Podcast Revived, which you can find at scaryofliteral.com, it's a podcast that is me and my wife talking about video games and other nerdy things, I decided I'm actually going to type up the post for it and publish it from my Surface Duo just to see how that would work. And I thought, well, look, if I'm trying to do productivity things on the Surface Duo, why don't I take this over the top and connect a Bluetooth mouse to the Surface Duo? Why not? Android supports Bluetooth mice. And then I thought, well, look, if I'm going to do that, I might as well bust out this guy. This guy is pretty cool. It's small. It's actually about the size of the Surface Duo, almost identical. Well, but what it actually is, is a Bluetooth keyboard. So you take this guy and this guy and you pair it to this guy. And what do you have? You have a productivity monster that can live in your pocket. So let's take a second and look at exactly how this would work. So what I did is I took the Duo and first I tried I tried setting it just like that. And I suppose that would totally work. You, you could, you know, have it just sort of sitting that way and, and that would be totally fine. If you had some sort of like a stand to lean it back, that would probably really be beneficial as well. But at any rate, I had it sitting like that. You set up your keyboard and you set up your mouse and there you go. So could you see yourself plunking down, you're in a hotel or something perhaps, and you don't have uh, in a lot of room to carry a laptop or something, this is just in your bag, plopping it down onto a table and using this as a workstation. I think you could. Here's a cool thing. You hit the Windows key and watch what happens. Open OneNote. Bada bing, bada boom. Pretty cool. So now I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to my quick notes. I'm going to open up. I'm going to start a new page. Let's uh, type in a, a test page. We're going to type in a test message. You can imagine something like what I do. You know, I use a lot of you know news pages and then write notes about things I want to talk about in videos. Let's say I'm over here on Twitter. Well, here's a news article. Let's click on that, open that up. All right, well, there's the article. Okay, the new iPad Air. Let's let's copy that text there and bring it over here. Let's get rid of this, and we'll paste it in. Okay, that works pretty well. Look, I don't think it's, you know, you have to have a lot of creativity here to imagine where something like this could actually come in handy. You could also even, you know, maybe turn it, turn it into, you know, this quote-unquote laptop orientation. Well, now now you've got different, you know, you basically have two three by two aspect ratio screens. And now when you go to type something over here, you're not going to have to deal with, you know, the keyboard popping up. You're getting some options down here, but you're typing with your actual keyboard. So you're not obstructing the screen. You have a better experience now scrolling through the web that way. And if you need to switch things around, you can drag that up top. You can drag this into the spanning view if you want more real estate to type in however you want to do it. It's actually quite a flexible little setup. I almost forgot, and if you want to get really crazy with this setup, let's say you've got a, a TV laying around in your hotel room or wherever it is you may be. Well, grab something like this. This is an HDMI to USB-C cable. Plug it directly into a bigger screen, and then you know output your Surface Duo's display to that larger screen. So look, I don't know who this is for, but the potential here is actually pretty cool. I mean, how, how easy would it be to throw into your bag a Surface Duo, a mouse, and this handy dandy foldy up keyboard? That's all you're carrying. And if you actually need to get stuff done, you totally could. So guys, is this stupid? Maybe. Did it make me happy? A little bit. I'll drop a link to this keyboard in the description if it looks like something that you would like to try. Honestly, it's a pretty solid little keyboard. Key travel is pretty good. It charges over a USB micro up here at the top. Battery life is really good. It, it, it'll stay charged for a really long time. And the portability is pretty much 
top of the line. So guys, that's about all I've got this time. I'll see you on the next video. So until then, stay nerdy, my friends. If you enjoy my content, please consider becoming a Scary If Literal member. You'll get access to a whole bunch of emoticons to use with live streams and a shout out on an upcoming video. Thanks as always for your continued support.